No, answer. It's, okay. It's, it's, answer. Uh, my question to you, way. answer. Answer. My question is this though: How do we measure the real time results? Like, what do how you do mean? we measure? Like, how do we measure, like, like the the validity of their relationship or like how deep they shit really is? If they shit is really good or what it's ain't like, because a lot of information comes out. They have a public view. The public views them in some way, right? What mm-hmm. we think is bullshit, or what we think is not bullshit. How do we then know measure if they got real life results? If they really rocking with each other and they really fucking happy? How well, do we how do we measure that? We we gotta take we gotta take every single part of it, right? So for example, for me, like one one way shit, Carrie, you ain't even let me answer the question before you shake your head. <laughs> I still yeah. haven't finished what I was saying, but I'm okay. Well, then I, I want to ask you her question too. I want Karen. you to answer first, then, because I want to give you the floor. I don't want you to feel no type of way and shake your head before I even answer the question. Go ahead, Carrie. I I, I still got my thoughts. It's right here. It's locked in. No, I I I agree with what King Spark is saying, but I'm not putting it in the form of a question because 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 to me, we looked at Usher and his girlfriend now wife we're looking at monique and her husband and in my eyes it's working for them in my eyes they're not doing they not doing any they're not doing anything in my opinion that is like if you follow this you going down a road for disaster from what i have seen what i have seen in this conversation alone two married men have been on this panel trying to understand why what's the upside to being married so you're telling me it that's more that's more beneficial for somebody to hear and follow than for her than than to listen to what she's saying ladies i was out of line i was out of line my husband had to help get me in order maybe i was or whatever i was beforehand because some people that's their story she can't change how she was but they've gotten through it and gotten out of it and they are standing next to one another. I don't understand how that mm-hmm. is not a positive thing. Like what Carrie. and and I'm even looking in the comments and I'm like, wow. I mean, not everybody in the comments, but some people in the comments, I'm just it's like somebody said Carrie thinks everything is so happy and Why whatever. Are you in the comments? Why because, you know that you're going to be in the comments. Quentin said something to me the other, uh, one of the other Mondays, so now I'm up in the comments. But, but anyway, care, okay, I'm care, see, care, you, you, care, you, you speaking with your wife now, okay? No, see, no, no, no. The, the, see, okay. you heard, you heard that, care, because you married and you, you think positively. What the other women in her like, hey, I can go get bust down twenty five times. Correct. Right. Dude, no. gonna take me for who I? Yes, it is. Not I'm if you, you what they hear. 2K. No. You, okay. Did you me giving to them hoes hope, and I don't like it. Did okay, you? I get that did bit. you? Did you listen to the interview? Thank you. I watched it. <laughs> so when you, so in listening to the whole interview, you really think women are gonna walk away with? I can get bust down twenty five times. Like they already there. Behind. They already there, Carrie. That that's I need this much. This I, one already there. I, 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 I agree. So far, I, I agree. I, the last point when she. I, I cut it out because I, I didn't want it to be a long video. So she was like, women, you know, what did she say? She said, if you're, if you're a whore, you're, you got friendly pum pum. So I cut it out. Mm-hmm. But, Thank you, Q. I'm that. glad that you acknowledge that part but because you did that's say what, that. Yes, but I definitely agree with Carrie. Before I heard that, I was like, damn, that was her best friend since 10th grade. He was there for her. He helped her. He molded her. She led. She even talked about her, her ex-husband that she, she was rah-rah and fighting with. And she he really molded her to a better woman, and I'm like, damn, that's crazy. And then I heard that, I'm like, damn. So like that positive, and then I heard the whore, the whore thing. I was like, damn. You that can't mold and look, like Plato. Hey, look, two K. Hey, two K. I will argue. I will argue that them whores it already be in their spirit though. Like them whores, like they start young, they start folding. I agree, but what you say? They already they out here. Is, it's either in your be, spirit or you ain't, and it, it might give hope to the ones that's already whores, but I don't think nah. it'll make see like we, we don't need no, decent. We don't need nobody motivating the hoes more than they being motivated. Nah, I don't think that it's already in their spirit. I believe that everything that we do is a learned behavior, it's in their spirit because of what they witness from their mamas. 
growing up. Time, you could agree growing up though, when it came to the freak jones, we didn't have to do too much motivating. Your man yeah, but called the, but, you and said that, hey, you know little Sherry be going. You know she sucked everybody dick last time. But again, but it, but and that's true. And now you are hundred percent right. But now that we adults we can look into and start to look at things in hindsight and realize that her mama was a hoe. And Big so when we, when we don't shame it and we don't address it, but then we validate it, this becomes a part of our cultural norm. And so now that we hold it, we can look over it and say, you know what, damn, shit. Like that's the reason why little, little, little homegirl over there was doing the shit that she was doing in high school was because she was watching her mama do the same shit that was in her, you know what I'm saying? Her mom, and it just be getting passed now. And so when she say, when Monique say, yo, listen, you not a whore. You was just community pussy temporarily or some shit. That validates the bad behavior. Because when you look in the comments, all of the women is, agree oh, yes, honey. And then they come with these outsized expectations. And they say dumb shit like, I deserve a good man. And it's like, and for me, I look at it on the other side and I say, well, what the fuck? He deserve a whore? That everybody uh, already fucked? I, I'm just saying that and the so, one so that Carrie not, not looking at it from that other lens. The only thing that Carrie is looking at it from is the good. She looking at it from the Disney character perspective. Oh yeah. my God, it was a happy ending. Carrie's you know, so annoyed. <laughs> She's looking, she looking at the happy ending. But Carrie is not really paying attention to the message that's being communicated. At the, the real end. message is being okay, communicated. Okay, first of all, I'm right now. I am trying to see the last part of of what you just played, Q. Why is she challenging I, us? No, I'm not challenging <laughs> you. I I legit did not hear. I didn't get to the part. Was it was this part at the end of the interview? It's at the end. I still it's have about the end. Minutes left. Okay. Yeah, the, yeah. So, that's why. That's so why her I, narrative hasn't changed because Carrie. I was thinking like you. When I was listening until I heard that, and I was like, "Damn!" So I need, in fairness, I need to listen. I, I'm, I'm, I'm not. Cheating. So, so, Q, hold on. so what you saying? Keyword not enough for you? No, 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 no. no. Mm. What I'm saying, what I'm saying is, and I, Carrie wouldn't be with no nigga that she gotta take care of either. So throw that shit. In there. <laughs> let, 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 let her talk. <laughs> Carrie wouldn't be the breadwinner either. So listen, the what Carrie said. I said Carrie is the Lulu. <laughs> don't, don't mean nothing because Carrie is not gonna be over here getting pimp at the same time either. So throw that in there. Okay, listen. Mm. I did. I did. I listened to about three fourths of the interview so far so i have not finished the part that you just played i did not hear that specific part for myself yet so i can't comment on that until i hear them because you cut it off right when she said friendly bump so i just want to hear the rest of the context but what i was saying was not specific to defending her that comment it was to the overall essence of what she was talking about regarding her and her husband's relationship so mm. i'm not saying i'm changing my tune i'm just saying that specific comment i'm not i don't know i gotta listen to and it not, and not on that said okay what i have you guys not seen trolls y'all didn't see trolls the movie mm -mm. Nah, y'all got enough no kids yeah <laughs> trolls y'all didn't see trolls? <laughs> what about it mean you Okay, well, on the first trolls, I wrote Poppy, the Minions ride at Universal. Poppy, Poppy is talking to to Branch, and he just cannot understand why she has such a positive view, and she can't understand why you have such a negative one. She said, "I choose to have a positive one. I choose to have a positive one. I choose to look at situations okay, oh shit, and Carrie. see what can like what what gem can I grab and what and what." What positive way I could see it? That's me. Well, that's Karen, me. It, it don't matter I how know positive people in the you. Comments call me disingenuous because of it, but that's just my spirit. That's how I am. So when I was it, listening, when I was listening to Monique, what I heard from her was transparency. What I perceived as honesty, only because a lot of what she was saying, it seemed easy to go and like disprove her if she's lying. It seemed like she was accountable for her behavior and it seems like her and her husband are locked in they're on the same page whether i agree with it or not it seems like they're locked in so to me 
to me, considering how easily y'all call women up here hoes, because Anton, you call women hoes tonight. You was like, no, ain't no hoe gonna be under me and not follow my whatever. Y'all use the term so loosely. She's just saying, that's where I came out of, and here I am now. Like, I just don't understand why it's like, he's a simp. That's that's a, that's a term of, like that's so a term of endearment. That's a term of endearment for community pussy. Listen, the, listen. The fact that she even divulged that information is her letting us know, like, damn, I did all this shit and still got married. Just the fact, and then on top of her promoting whole culture, she promoting that overweight women can do this shit. Like, who, like, oh shit, oh, that's yeah. the bailout. 